Solutions. Uh, after that, Tamara's going to come up. She's got a cool outdoor show, and then we've got our uh, electronics show coming up after that. But I would love to invite you to enjoy uh, this uh, holiday weekend with us. Uh, in honoring this weekend, we're actually doing five flex or more on everything uh, in our show. So it's a great way to be able to celebrate. I hope you're having a safe Memorial Day weekend. We are going to start you off with one of my absolute favorite new items um, that, that's come along. You know, air frying has been around for a little bit, but there are, those, there are air fryers that are really, really good ones and ones that you can go and you can cheap out um, at your electronic stores and things like that. This one is top of the line. It comes from Elite. It's called the Bistro. It's a digital uh, touchscreen air fryer. If you love the crispy French fries and you love the uh, wonderful like mozzarella sticks, buffalo wings, anything you want to cook, you can cook in an air fryer. But here's the best part. When cooking in an air fryer, because you're using circulating superheated air um, that circulates around the food, you don't have to have it soaking in a bunch of oil like you do in a deep fat fryer. So it's, it gives you that same result of crispy cooking, does it in a fraction of the time without the mess, without buying the oil, and the results are amazing. My producer, Paul, just got his air fryer and told me, oh my gosh, guy, I've been working on cooking on it every single day. Kelly Deidring is here. I'm gonna walk over and see lovely Miss Kelly. I love, first me of all, too. Elite is an amazing. Yes. Company. They they uh, started off here a while back doing um, doing um, pressure cookers yes. and things like that. Yes. So they really understand the process of cooking food. I am telling you that first of all the size five <laughs> five point six quarts. So exactly. you can do an entire Look at chicken in here. What do you love about air frying? Well, I love air frying because the calories are so much yeah. lower, right? So if yep. you're trying to that's get healthy, starts to love that's it. how you start to love it, yeah. and then you begin to love it because of the flavors, yes. right? So when you're air frying, you're still frying. I don't want you to think you're not going to still get that crispness that crunch that we all crave, but you're frying with hot air. It's superheated air that spins inside the air fryer, kissing every morsel of your food, crisping it up instead of using oil. So for example, you can get that crispy exterior on your chicken skin with a five pound chicken Ooh. and you do it in about 45 minutes. So you don't have to even turn on an oven, get out a rotisserie, yeah. go to the grocery store and buy the stuff that's filled with, you know, whatever. Right. Five pound chicken oh my gosh, right Kelly. here in Look our it. air fryer. And it's going to be juicy, tender, and beautiful. Now, most of you might be thinking, wow, every air fryer I've ever seen is teeny tiny, right? Oh, it smells so good. Most yeah. of the air fryers, and don't get me wrong, they're two and $300 air fryers. They hold a single sandwich. One little sandwich, yeah, right? They're it. small. They have that little basket. Elite Bistro said that is not enough, right? No, we want to give you the family size air fryer yeah. and I'll show you this basket comes out, right? So it's vented and then the oil goes underneath. So look what I didn't even eat. You the wanna... natural oils from yeah. my, yeah. And we yeah. can pour that in there and you'll see it's, a, it's about uh, a half a cup to three quarters of a cup of oil that comes off the chicken. Listen, the skin is great for, for keeping the moisture in, yep. but once it uh, leaches out all of its oil, you don't want to. You don't want to drink all this that. stuff. Hey, okay, you can skim this off, and there's Look a little bit of residual juice, and you can make a great gravy out of that as well. The cleanup is easy because this is all nonstick interior on the inside. But the key to the whole thing is having that basket where the air can circulate around. It's very and true. And inside the channels, uh, the the vents and channels inside circulate that air all the way around the food, so it gives you that crispy exterior every time. And it works on on anything. You on put in anything. There. So yeah. from a full five pound chicken to a full bag of frozen french fries. This is, yeah. might be one of my very favorite things to do in an air fryer because french fries before air frying, you could only do them in a deep fryer. Otherwise, right. it was a waste of calories because yeah. they were mushy in an oven, and right? You gotta heat the whole oven, heat the whole to oven. they get fries. soggy. Yeah. Now you can take totally frozen. This is a bag of frozen french fries. They could be steak fries. They could be potato wedges. They could be fresh if you want. All you do is pop it inside your air fryer and then we have a digital display. So as you turn it on, mm -hmm. it automatically lights up. Now what's cool about ours and most of them are, are manual you have to dial up and right. figure out high medium low all that this one has a menu button with pre-programmed settings it even has pictures so for example that's showing seafood that's showing fish this one down here is actually showing a picture of french fries that's where I'm going with this yeah. and then I hit that start button it knows that I need it at 392 it knows that I need it right around 15 to 20 minutes and it will cook my french fries literally with the touch of a button pre-programmed yeah. into that beautiful digital display. It's so simple. If, if you're out there and you're one of those people that doesn't know how to cook or you say, you know, I'm, I always have questions about what I'm doing. Try an air fryer. Uh, first of all, uh, on the top of the air fryer, there's all these presets that tell you how easy and for how long <laughs> you need pictures, to cook things. And pictures, yes. Um, but, oh my gosh, yeah, that's, so, yeah, I was trying to get to that. I look, mean, I want you to look at this chicken. Can you see the juice and the moisture what? that's 
you know, just look at it. Hold it up. It's tripping. Do you inside see it? the white meat. <laughs> that look is at amazing. The, and that crispy exterior, you would only get, you know, if you did that, you know, cumbersome yeah. rotisserie type of experience. Now you can do it in your air fryer. I'm going to give this to you. It's hot. Let it cool. Right. Yeah. You want to put it right over here? Or what do you there do? You go, my All right. I got to eat this thing. You thing. do have to eat it because you get that crispy exterior, no oil. So it's not like you're deep frying your chicken, right? It seals oh in the moisture based on superheated, supercharged, hot, hot air. And that's, that's what's most important about air frying. But up oh until God. now, guy mm. knows that air fryers were $200 and above. You might find a sale for like mm. 189 bucks, mm. but that was expensive to test out a new appliance. If you don't want to spend $300 or more, right. try ours. Ours is the same technology. Uh, yeah, and I think they save you money because you're not heating up a giant oven every time you want to cook something. <laughs> oh my Look gosh. at these grilled cheese. I've been waiting for these grilled cheese. They were done about yes. five minutes he, ago. He wanted to take a picture and just say, look, yeah. that's what they were. were. I want to eat right. it. I want look, you to look at that. that now, that is a perfect grilled cheese, if you ask me. It is gorgeous. It is golden brown. <laughs> it is crispy and crunchy. And I didn't get out a single frying pan. Wow. I didn't have to coat it with oil. Now, you could do like a little butter on the outside. You could give it a little spritz or spray if you want. But you don't have to. That's Hold the up. beauty of the air fryer. Let's see if this is a, you think this is a good grilled cheese? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, my God. Yeah, I don't think that's a good grill. No, this one's got to go back. Are you kidding me? Is that not amazing? And look at the bread. Look at this grilled cheese. Crisped and crunched to perfection inside your air fryer. That's two oversized grilled cheeses. Go ahead. When you look at other air fryers on the market, they're $250 and they can fit a single grilled cheese. Well, what does that mean for your family of four? You have to put a grilled cheese in, that person eats. Put another grilled cheese in, that person eats. Not with the Elite Bistro Air Fryer. I'd buy it just to make that grilled cheese. I know, it's kind of amazing. It, it's, well, that's actually a triple grilled cheese. It's three different cheeses. If you've never had a grilled cheese inside here, and it's amazing because I'm, you know, I'm old school where you put it in a pan, you fry it in butter and stuff like that. It actually bakes inside yes. there. <laughs> and it tastes like... It's a whole different taste. Yeah. I mean, it, it is like, the whole thing has that roasted taste to it, yes. right? And by the way, when we did that chicken, we also roasted vegetables. If you want your kids to eat your vegetables, roast cauliflower and Brussels sprouts inside Crunching this thing. up a vegetable makes it taste like a thousand percent better. Unbelievable. Sorry, I gotta go back in there. No, go back in there. That grilled cheese has your name on it. Remember, this is a digital display. Most air fryers have a mm. manual display. And you're left to figure out, well, do I want high? Do I want medium? Do I want low? Not with the Elite Bistro. Here's my little tip. When you get it home and you mm -hmm. can't figure out how to get that to light up, hit that button for three to five seconds. That's wow. what activates the button. And then when you go to that menu, because I'm doing friend... I'm doing um, nuggets. I'm doing potato nuggets. Yeah. What are they called? What? Potato nuggets. Tater tot. Tater tot. I lost that word tots. in my brain. Tot. Yeah. Um, I'm going to use that French fry button, and all of a sudden, it's going to pop on, and I'm going to do the most beautiful, crunchy tater tots like you get at the you know drive through. You know which right. drive through I'm talking yeah, about yeah, that yeah. does a really good tater tot. <clears throat> yes. That's what it's going to taste like, but I've used no oil. All right. I want you all to sit back. I want you this to is see your, one of my this is your dream. <laughs> things ever. So show it. We'll show it quickly in the inside. So this is the way chicken wings are supposed to look when they're cooked. Five pounds. This is the way they look normally when you deep fry them, yes. although the deep frying makes them soaked in oil. Five pounds. <clears throat> this is five pounds. I'm going to help you because some of them aren't making it. There I'm you go. Sorry. <laughs> that's all right. You're doing a good a job. short this morning. <clears throat> well, you're trying not to let the grease get out, and yes. I think that's really smart yep. because there's grease in the bottom. And we'll put our chicken wings. In my opinion, and I have run restaurants, as you know, 15, 20 years in yep. different restaurants. I actually ran a sports bar where we went through, you know, four or 500 pounds of chicken wings every day. And you had to get dispose of the oil, didn't you? Exactly. So Look these are unbelievable. We'll just do a little. Yeah, so you can buy whatever, you know, brand, whether you do frozen or fresh, <laughs> and pop them in your air fryer and this. do a taste test for your, that like, wins. most discerning group of friends, whether it's your guy friends, your right. girlfriends, you know, the, the teenagers, do a taste test. Yeah. They will not know that you have not deep fried their chicken wings. Oh, they're no. crunchy, yeah. they're juicy, they retain all the flavors, it happens faster. I didn't have to buy two gallons of the oil, right. put it in my deep fryer, heat up my 
my deep fryer, have that hot oil popping all over my yeah. kitchen, have that smell all over my kitchen. Your air fryer is quiet. It doesn't take up very much energy, right? Yeah. So you're not, you know, plugging it in and turning down your air conditioner. You're going to absolutely love switching to an air fryer. Now, Guy has been, like, losing it over what yeah, I'm well, revealing. Because Renee put these things in. You're going to die. Okay. They're, they're, uh, do you know what that is? Let me just tell everybody. What it is. It's, a, avocado. it's an avocado that he stuffed with a, an egg. An egg. And a little bit and of like tomato. And like some cheese and like some, oh my gosh. So I these are the kinds parsley. of things you can do you can without... Do without heating up anything. You, you know? wouldn't want to turn on your oven for two avocados. You want to get out your air fryer. Leave your air fryer on the counter. Uh, he's got you a spoon. I want you to, you here. You scoop it out and put or it on there? you could do it with your toe. Okay, do it with right, the toe. I'm, I'm gonna take this one. But all you no, do is this. you just open up a little of the avocado, take a little of the avocado out, eat it, because it's oh, so wait, incredibly wait. healthy. You gotta look at this. And then you pop your Hold egg on. inside, and then you air fry it, and then you could dip your toast what? in it. It's like you're at what? a restaurant, <laughs> like those breakfast places. Is that not amazing? I want to know what this tastes like, because this is brand new. Is it as amazing as it looks? That's it's like... to die for. That's like for adults only right there. Is that it, is is it so that good? I got to get Amazingly, a spoon. Look at inside. See the avocado? And the avocado is crunchy, and look at the egg. Okay. We made that. That is that is absolutely... You outdid yourself there, Renee, wherever you are out there. That is amazing. And, and what's oh, nice, gosh, too, is that... You wouldn't want to put like four of those in a big giant oven because you'd waste all that oven space and you'd waste all that energy. Right, and then you'd be turning your air conditioning down. But this bakes and roasts and broils and does all that at the same time. So if you're, whether you're doing breakfast, lunch, or dinner, yep. it's so easy to throw some stuff in here and get it done really, really quickly. That's what I love about it is like, you'll use oh, look it. At these. You know, like our producer Paul um, just bought one and Paul yes. said to me, he's like, oh my gosh, guy. You know, I bought it. You know, you buy it thinking, okay, it'd be great for parties. He's been using every it every single day. Single day yes. He's been using it, and that's the fun part. And, and by the way, I want you to look at look these, at at these tenders. All right, these are you fish see sticks. How, are there these fish sticks? Yes. Look at. I'll hold this one because it's a little closer to you. This look is at, an ode to Paul, right? This is and a fish and chips. Up. Paul, this is for you. This is for English Paul. Yeah. Paul, look at that, and you know, and if you look at my fingers, you'll see my fingers are not greasy. Look, my fingers are not And look greasy. at the crunchy french fries. Look at the, and look at the fish inside. Wow. Isn't that amazing? That's awesome. So fish and chips, whether you want to do chicken nuggets, chicken fingers, whether you want to do sausages. I just read a recipe for hamburgers. Um, you know, Paul was telling us he did mm. hamburgers inside here. It's not just for a traditional fried food. It is for those fried foods, but it's for everything else. Mm. Think of it as a replacement for your big giant box oven, right? That sucks up all the energy where you have to turn your air conditioning now, <clears throat> down. Now you have this giant electric bill. Oh, yeah. This is quiet. Read the reviews. Uh, people love it. It's very quiet. It's very easy to use. There's a nonstick basket, and then there's a little eject button, and that basket pops out. This is dishwasher safe. So if you want to throw this in the dishwasher, be my guest. I use my air fryer enough that I don't put it in the dishwasher because I don't want to be without it if I don't right. run the dishwasher right away. So I just rinse mine clean. But it comes with that air fry basket that pops right on the inside. It's Elite Bistro. So if you own one of our yeah pressure cookers, you know the quality is second to none, right? Right. They don't skimp. The reason that it's a better price point than the rest of the marketplace is because we've been with HSN so long, they have this wonderful buying power. They can bring right. in so many air fryers that we can pass the savings on to you. Yep. yep. And by the way, uh, it's, cool, it's cooler to the touch on the outside, so you don't have to worry about that. That's the difference when people say, I can get a toaster oven. Well, toaster ovens don't usually have convection, and if they did, they're going to be burning hot. I had a toaster oven, and I had to. I, it actually would heat up my cabinets so hot, yep. I had to move it. So these stay cool on the outside. These are on. You have the little helper uh, cheat sheet on top, which tells yep. you the amount of time and the temperature for french fries, um, whether you're doing chicken nuggets, whether you're doing chicken wings, hamburger patties, all that stuff. Plus, we have the recipe book, which is... 16 full-color recipes. We've got them in a grab. It. So 16 Let me show you. We'll, we'll show full you some color samples. recipes so, coming for the first time from uh, Elite Bistro. You can Bistro. do fried green tomatoes, you can do fish fillets, Cajun chicken, you can do skirt steak, which is really good inside there. I've got, actually, I have Curtis Stone steaks coming up next. You could pop one of those sirloins in there, one of those ribeyes in there. By the way, the Curtis Stone steaks, which are coming up uh, with my friend Chef Kat, are going to sell out. So just a sneak peek if you want to get those. They were on and they sold out in one airing. So I have those back and those are coming up. But you could pop a steak in here. You could oh, put chicken absolutely. in here. Absolutely. If, you, if you're in you a hurry, you're in a vegetables. Pinch. Yeah, and you want to buy something frozen from the store like a stuffed chicken breast. 
You could do that crab cakes. You could do oh, anything you could fry. Oh, crab cakes taste amazing in here. Okay, these, what, what are these? mac and cheese balls. <laughs> oh my God. Fried mac and cheese balls. They're what the most amazing me, thing that you might ever, you know, sort of try. But you do the mac and cheese and then you just form it into a little ball. You do a little wash and then you do your breadcrumbs. But you can do as sophisticated and fun you know, like mac and cheese balls to a bag of frozen french fries and every single time you will be impressed by the results. Not just the fact that you're saving electricity, not just the fact that you're saving calories and oil and you're not ingesting all that oil, but the flavors. I crave a crunch. I think it's like a psychological like addiction. Don't we all crave oh that gosh. crunch? Yeah, you do, you You've do. You gotta have the crunch or some things just, it's like, we, well, otherwise we'd all eat salad all day, every day. Right, we but, don't. But, but the crunch, uh, usually we're trained to think that can only come if you deep fat deep fry, fry something. It. Yep. And don't get me wrong, you can get it that way very easily, but you're talking about 10 times, 20 times, 30 times the calories in French fries that are deep fried versus those that are air fried. Now, when you buy a bag of fries uh, from the store, those are normally going to be fried, okay? They fry them, they dry them out, they season them, whatever, they freeze them and they put them in a bag. If you refry those again, think oh, about how much dump, oil you're yeah. getting inside. That's a really and the good reason point. that we put them in an air fryer is because of some of the oil that they've been originally fried in is going to drip out. So you don't have that on your food yes. as well. You can do it. Did you bake it? Yes. So that's that what I was going to say. Anything that'll go into your oven can go inside your air fryer. So think about things like maybe a small spring form pan yeah. or a small little bread little, loaf. A little mini cake. This is like, yeah, a little mini cake. You could do cupcakes on the inside. This is a, a rosemary focaccia bread. But I mean, think of it could do monkey bread or pull apart bread, cinnamon bread. On the inside there, it's so large that we have the ability to put in other vessels. Most air fryers can barely fit a piece of bread, right? Yeah. But for a sandwich. They're these small little baskets, and most people complain. It's like, I just spent $3 on an air fryer that does a single sandwich. Yeah. Now you're spending less than a third of that price to get that 5.6 quarts, to get that digital display that has all the memory programmed into the front of it. It has more features and benefits for an air fryer than yeah. you know the $300 air fryer. It's got all the preset functions. There is a 30 minute timer and automatic shut off, so you don't have to worry about that. If you Listen, if you, live alone or if you live with a partner or maybe an empty nest or whatever, you gotta try this, because I'm telling you, you'll probably never use your regular oven again except for holiday. Yep. And by the way, this is really great to have for holiday Look too, because this. you can do a lot of things inside here in addition to your regular oven. Yes. So you can get things done. You could put a, uh, a probably a four or five bone prime rib in there. Yes. Look at uh, how beautiful we did a rack of pork. That, that I mean, roast is beautiful. Is that not beautiful? Yeah. And I mean, so that's what I mean. You can get as sophisticated as you want, or yeah. you know, you can do simple things like um, you know, a bag of French fries or, you know, bag of chicken nuggets or, yeah, you know, cut. a couple of quick burgers. I know you wanted this. to cut into yeah, this. Yeah, we need to cut it's it. It's absolutely going to be, you Probably know, your favorite a, purchase. Probably cutting board to do this one. Isn't that gorgeous, It's though. beautiful. Just trying to get it up. There we go. Look at how perfectly cooked. I want you to look inside. Cooked. Look at, look at, look at I the mean, it's moist on the inside. Oh, my gosh. Crunchy Kelly. on the outside. All right, well, you and your team outdid themselves. This is amazing. I'm gonna save, um, I'll save you a few things. Save me some. We're going to step away. we got much more come. Curtis Stone Steaks coming your way next. Don't miss a thing with our HSN app, available on Apple and Android.